Xiaomi sets ambitious production goals for SU7 electric sedan. Xiaomi is aiming to manufacture 50,000 to 60,000 units of the SU7 electric sedan this year, with orders surpassing 100,000. According to financial research firm Credit Sites, Xiaomi plans to deliver 60,000 vehicles in 2024, despite expecting losses in the initial two years. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the like button. Local media sources reveal that Xiaomi's Beijing factory currently has a production capacity of 4,000 to 5,000 units per month, expected to increase to 6,000 units by year-end. This projection could potentially yield around 53,000 mass. Produced vehicles in 2024, including 5,000 Founder Edition FE cars completed before the March 28 launch. The FE models, which cater to Xiaomi's devoted fan base, offer exclusive perks and benefits. Despite the significant demand, with Xiaomi reportedly producing 300 cars daily, waiting times for new orders have stretched to up to eight months. The Xiaomi SU7, an electric sedan boasting a range of 700 kilometers, debuted in China on March 28 at a starting price of 215,900 yuan, approximately $29,900 USD. Orders flooded in, with 50,000 placed within the first 27 minutes and reaching 100,000 by Wednesday. Customers placing orders are required to make a deposit of 5,000 yuan, $700 USD, which becomes non-refundable after seven days. Choosing to lock in the configuration immediately renders the deposit non-refundable. To date, Xiaomi has received 40,000 lock-in orders. Acknowledging losses on the entry-level variant SU7 RDD standard, Xiaomi CEO Lei Jun revealed that deliveries for the SU7 standard and Max A OET variants will commence in late April, with the Pro variant following in May, boasting an impressive 830 km TLTC range. In response to the overwhelming demand, Xiaomi has urged its suppliers to ramp up production capacity to match the factory's monthly output of 10,000 units. The SU7 is contract manufactured by state-owned BIC at the Beijing plant, with the factory's current capacity set at 150,000 units per year. Construction of the second phase of the factory is slated to commence in 2025, doubling the plant's output to 300,000 units per year. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the like button.